Hey everybody, this is Toxic from 2 for 2 and today I'm going to be demonstrating the um, A6 Little Bird HUD that I found by Google. So, one, as you can tell, there's a large force of, you know, U.S. military heading to the um, air airfield to the far north of this position, of this airfield. So, we have been assigned to go help, so we're going to hop in our little bird and go help. It's... The hood is actually pretty well done. Um, it's really easy to use, and it actually is accurate on how it actually works, so... As you can see, here it is. This is, it actually does have cycling mode, so switch to the guns, it has this. It stays the same for both high and low. But then, you know, changes to the regular armor. <laughs> Symbol for rocket, firing rockets. Um, as you can see, you can move it from head to head. It's not actually on the helicopter, it's actually mounted on your helmet. But, um, that's how you're able to move it now as you can see it actually does update information it does not just sit there and as you move it you can actually tell now one thing i really like about it is it's not like all the other huds where if you move it the guns will actually for some reason go over there if i fire it'll go straight that way. it won't change it just helps out so as you can tell it actually does keep the same altitude if you look at the top of the screen to the left and then on the right, I'm not sure exactly what that does. Oh, I'm sorry. The one on the right is the altitude, and the one on the left is the speed. So as you can see, if you look at the hood, on the right side, the numbers that are moving is my speed, which is actually accurate with the game. And on the right side is my altitude, which is actually accurate with the game. As you can it also gives me a round count. And how so... Like right now, by looking at my hood, I can tell that I have 14, 2.75 cal, well, 68, so I don't know if I pronounced that right. Pronounce that right. Also, I have my gun on low. I have my minigun right there on low. So, my also switches to high, and I have 5,238 rounds on it. It's not, it's not... I mean, it's more realistic, and I like it how, and this is the zoomed in part. I like it, but, you know, you can still use the HUD on top that's actually built into the game. So, we're on our way to this, um, we're on our way to support the UN, uh, to give a little backdrop on what we're doing. UN's actually attacking the airfield because the Russians have breached some type of contract. I don't know, I'm just, uh, you know, I'm just a pilot. I really don't know what type of contract or whatever so the UN's going over there and to try and fix it they meant heavy resistance so earlier you saw that the co Cobras are going over there I'm pretty much just you know sweeping extra security because I'm not as big as them so we're actually coming up on the area now I think yep we are so we're coming on Rasmin and there's the airfield and let's so how the HUD actually works so far, okay, we got a big, we have a couple fires, that's UN right there, so we're gonna go ahead, and there's the tanks. I'm gonna use my hood to attack the... And as you can see, I'm dead. But, um, you know, it's not, it was more of a, you know, video on how to do the hood than actually how to, um, Fly, which is actually horrible, which I'm not good at at all. So, you know. But yeah, so, you no, know, like I said, it's not really perfect or anything. But it's something, and you know. I have no idea what happened to these Cobras over there. They should have went and did something, but apparently they didn't. So, you know, you know how that works. So, I'm gonna do a little friendly fire here, maybe. No, okay. There we go. So, uh, yeah. 
so I hope you enjoyed the video or whatever and I hope this kind of even though it was a fail helped you out and on this good note I will sacrifice one of the US soldiers for you all so okay horrible hip fire just die already thank you yeah, I'll sacrifice him also but yeah with that I it, I'm dead and I wish you a good night slash day slash whatever time you're watching this. Goodbye.